Duo dental scopes have been long recognized to be difficult to clean and disinfect. Endoscope reprocessing is essential for infection risk mitigation in ERCP. Research shows that in 45% of cases, reprocessing steps are skipped. Additionally, 75% of the reprocessing staff reported time pressures and non-compliance with guidelines related to reprocessing as a result. On the 9th of October, experts in endoscopy gathered at Pentax Medical's R&D Center in Augsburg to discuss ways to mitigate the risk of infection. This is an opportunity to get people who have an interest and expertise in the field of decontamination together um, to talk about, to share expertise, to share ideas. Hygiene, as it is in any walk of medical life, is critical. And I think specifically in endoscopy, because it's an area that is growing in terms of its importance as both a key diagnostic test, but also in terms of the increasing use of it as a therapeutic intervention. Flexible endoscopes are uh, known as complex devices, uh, which are uh, difficult to clean, but it's very important to clean them because they are reused. Uh, we see a lot of time pressure in endoscopy reprocessing units because the high turnover of flexible endoscopes and that can lead to mistakes made by humans. Risk of infection is a serious topic. This was reinforced in August of this year by the US Food and Drug Administration when they called upon healthcare facilities and manufacturers to begin transitioning to duodenoscopes with disposable components to reduce the risk of patient infection. What we can do immediately is to make sure that the cleaning process of non-disposable scopes is as optimal as possible, so training personnel. The second is the existing non-disposable scopes to modify them, to make them so that you have disposable parts, in particular those parts that we know are most susceptible to contamination. And the third solution, the ultimate solution, would be to have disposable scopes. So Pentax firmly believes that licking and, and meeting with all of the stakeholders is really critical. We want to ensure that we can incorporate all of their feedback, their concerns, and also address new device designs that will allow us to improve clinical patient safety. Um, by bringing all the stakeholders together, whether it's clinicians, regulators, or other partners, it allows us to hear all the inputs that are necessary to design the safest possible uh, devices for the marketplace. The ERCP procedure performed with a non-disposable endoscope remains safe and provides clinicians with a significant diagnostic and therapeutic utility for disease evaluation and treatment. However, as the importance of ERCP procedures and their impacts on patients' lives remains unwavering, the experts present at the round table committed to keep raising the importance of infection control and to keep looking for new solutions, now and in the future.